Let's make our way through the darkness. I guess I'm gonna go this way. I don't know where the monster is currently hiding, but hopefully it's not this way. <laughs> Yep, yep. The monster might be guarding something, though. That's just the thing. The monster has a tendency to like to guard things, I've noticed. So, let's see how this all plays out. I'm gonna check the top left hand corner, but if I hear the monster, I'm out. Though I think it might move. Oh, fuck my life! He was just waiting secretly behind the corner. What a douche. He's getting smarter though. He's holding his breath just so he could surprise us. Did I never go this way? Fuck, this could be my death. Or it could be my salvation. I don't know where this goes to. Get my stamina back. I think we might have outrun him for now. But I don't even know where this is. Uh, let's go this way. Of course I'm streaming until I beat the game. Jeez, this area is another one of those convolted areas. That's, that's just the door. This, this, I don't even know what area I'm in. Officer's rooms. At least I can explore this one. Table? It seems as if there was someone in the room only moments ago. Dresser. There's nothing in the dressers. dressers. I mean, so what's the point of this room? Can I hit with a crowbar? Can I not use the call of my people? <laughs> no. Yeah, there's not much here. Here's hoping that sound means I'm close to the control room or whatever. Well, I promise this sound sounds similar to the monster sound, so... The monster could disguise its sound if you really wanted to around here. Bear bell. I'll take it. Speed, speed, speed. I don't exactly know where I'm going. But I'm exploring. That's all I know. Don't have the control room stuff open, so this area is still blocked off. At least I have my map now. It's all locked. Have to find the control room. Yes, you do. Let's go over this way, then. So this is going to be a, another conveyor belt. No, there's actually something hidden up here. I wasn't predicting that. So, what's this? Please let this door be important. You used the blue car. Oh, this is the control room. Thank God. I actually went this way. Control room. Here's the device. Looks like I have a sci fi movie. You've said that before. This one's a slightly different angle, but let's press the control switch. Press the button. Yes. All machines in the room have stopped. Pushing the button must have deactivated the security alarm. Alright, alright. We found it. Thankfully, I happy I looked in that corner. I was actually about to bypass. I think it was just a conveyor belt. But that's why checking corners is important. Except that corner, because we know it's a dead end. Which means we should be able to escape this area now. Uh, I still haven't fully finished exploring this area. This is the area I've explored the least in being Mr. Aesthetic Gamer's game, my nerves a bit, but that's okay. Not really nerves, that's too strong of a word for this. Let's go to the right. So many stops all about. What will I see over here? Another twist in the curve? Sure, this area is really twisty-turvy. Seems to relish in how twisty-turvy it is. I don't know where this leads to, though. I'm just kind of following the pathway. I don't want to run in case the monster's, like, hiding from me up ahead or something. Is there a door here? There's a door on my map, but... I guess the door is supposed to be this way? This is kind of weird. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> you popped up and scared me. Looks like there's something here. Doesn't this look suspicious to you? Well, yes. Yes, it does. And my map tells me that there's a door here. Oh, 
Is this it? There's a card slot. Use the iron card. Well, I found something. What's going up? I don't know what this is, but I'll take it. Don't want to save. I'll make a new save slot and I'll save there and yai. Tokyo Mesh Third Floor Command Center. So this is related to that command center I saw earlier. This is under it, actually. Interesting. I didn't think that would even be a possibility, but I guess it is. Well, I guess we'll explore this area. There's a door here. I'm gonna open it now. Command Center. Central control panel. There's a large table with all kinds of machines attached to it. ID card reader. There's what looks like a car, like card slots lined up. ID card slot one. Looks like a card could be inserted here. World map. The colors on it have almost completely faded away. Computer. They certainly don't have anything like this during the war. Which means it must belong to the Holy Ring. Now do I insert the cards I think I insert? Red card. The card fits! I'm not wrong. Green card. That card won't fit. So is the blue card. The card fits! Green card. The card fits! All the slots have been filled! Looks like a card reader up here. Can I look at the CD-ROM on the computer, actually? You insert the CD-ROM into the computer's disk drive. That actually worked! Or a Canlin system to activate, Church Administrator Roaster, Celestial Observation Manager, a Cloga Celestial Division Manager name, Anatomy Division Manager, Assault Akira, Proselytization Division Manager, Assault, Eternal Affairs Division, Assault, Assault Sapin. Huh. I'm surprised that works. The list goes on and on, no point in reading it any further. Certainly not have anything like this during the war. Yeah, well I'm surprised that my miscellaneous idea actually worked. This, was this open before? Maybe, maybe not. I'll check it out though. Just passing through. Don't mind me. Let's open this up. Underground Captain South Station. Clock. It's an old clock. Looks like it hasn't been worked for in years. Mechanized wicket. Do you want to enter the station? Not yet. Sure, actually, you know what? I will enter the station. This is the only way to get to the Great Hall, then we have no choice but to ride it, no? Just think, if there is an accident or if the train derails, then there would be no way to fix it or get back out. Well, looks like we arrived, all right, boy. In the end, though, we just have to trust in God, because all of our worry and thinking won't change anything, no? Au revoir, mon ami! She's French. I guess the way was to give her away, but Rain jumped off the train. But I say it all the time, and I'm not French. But I don't mean it as in hi or we oui or whatever. Yes. No, I'm okay.
Tokyo Mess Great Hall. We're getting to a very cultish right like surrounding, aren't we? Well, I guess if we've come this far, we might as well go all the way, right? That's the spirit, Naomi. What's up with that Kamiya guy? I have absolutely no idea what he was talking about. Did you? Sounds to me like he's missing a few screws, know what I mean? Now maybe we can get back to the surface. We've got to be careful make sure they don't spot us. Ceremony of Wake, they don't know what's happening there. What's up with the... Okay, yeah, she's just kind of repeating her dialogue now. Let's go explore this area. Can I observe this lantern? No. We're going to the underground cult-like places. Who knows what sort of cult-like secrets might be down here. I wonder if you actually have to avoid cult members, or if they'd even 3D model that or not. It's kind of moving on ahead. This is the Hell Knight. Oh, this place is literally called Hell Knight, I think. Or maybe that's just the game name. I'm just stupidly game this wrong because I, it's been a while since I paid attention to the left thing on the left side. There's a huge door blocking the way. It doesn't look like there's any way to open it. Oh, to the Great Hall we go. Twists and turns and other strange turns, I guess, suppose. Oh boy. Ah, uh, there's a crack here. Can I open it? There's a crack in the wall with a little work. It could be used to enter the temple. Do you want to enter the temple? Not yet. Well, that's an obvious 2D image there. I just kind of want to see what's on the other side first. Call me curious, but I'm curious what's over here. Is there a crack on the other side? Is there something bad over here? Something good over here? There's a shaft going straight down. Do you want to go down the hole? No. Geez, now they're giving me two choices. I'll go through the crack. Sure. At least now I know that there's two things here. The crack sounds like a bad idea, though, if I can be completely frankly honest. Let's go. Want to go into the temple? Yes. Great hall. This is probably not what I'm supposed to do. Elevator shaft. There's the elevator. If we can just get to it, we can get back to the surface. We can get back home. Holy Rain Priest. Oh, geez, it looks creepy. Look at all those people. What's supposed to happen in this ceremony of awakening? That's her talking, that's not him talking. That's the voice I want to give him, though. Look at all those people. What's supposed to be happening in this ceremony of awakening, anyway? Strange stone. There's some kind of black ball there. Looks like it's moving, pulsating. Must be a trick of the light. Uh-oh.
Well, that was weird, but interesting. It's that one guy. <laughs> Those fools in the Holy Reen. Looks like they met their end at the same time as their great hall. They thought to become one with the Dark Messiah, and so offered themselves to the Hive. <laughs> the pathetic fools. Still, a part of me feels sorry for them. After all, they were simply manipulated by the witch whispers, and once they were no longer needed, were simply cast aside. Still, what's done is done. No use wasting time over it, eh? You are on the outskirts of the Hive. This is a world totally different from your own. A world beyond your limited reasoning or imaginations. A world where your physics do not rule. What are we supposed to do? Survive, just as you have until now. You must run through the dark. You must hide. You must flee, if you do. If we do? You will see... You will see the beginning of the world and the end of the world. You will see just how precious or precarious the existence of this world of yours is. For now, you must seek the altar. That is the only way, the only way you can survive. Hive outskirts. Well, this is different. I'm going to do two things quickly. I'm going to save slot one and save state there. But I'm also going to go to save slot 5 because I want to check something, just briefly. I want to see what's down here, which we didn't look at. Go down the hole. Let's see what was down this hole. Tokyo Mesh 4th floor, isolated floor. What the hell is all this decision making stuff? I could have totally missed this. So it's safe to save over this. Let's just explore this area a little bit. Starting with you. Fusion reactor. Fusion reactor Amaterasu. It's a huge reactor. It looks very old. There's cracks everywhere and a steam. Lack and steam lacking out here and there. It's probably not a good idea to stay around here too long. Grave plate. Fusion reactor Amatera or Amaterasu completed February 6, 1944. Activated October 28, 1944. Jeez, I could have missed this whole entire area if I had just. Well, let's explore. See what all here is on the quote-unquote isolated floor. Apparently a dead end. Hello, dead end. What's over this way, then? Another door. Doesn't look like this can be opened. Is there a point to this door, though? That I'm less certain about. Let's move around the twist and turns. Is there anything we can do there? I wonder what we're going to do with that ceremony waking up there. I think it's the one that we're on, so let's load. Here we go. Let's go to the outskirts. Da 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 da. Continuing along the way. Those look legitimately creepy. This area is very different aesthetically than every other area we've been in so far. Hive outskirts, you say. Gonna have to be a bit wary here. That almost looks like a passageway. I'll take it. People said earlier that this game kind of reminded them of the, the visual look kind of reminded them of LSD. This area, more than anywhere, is making me think of LSD Dream Emulator. It looks like an area that wouldn't be too out of place in LSD. Looks like, this game looks a little bit better graphically than LSD Dream Emulator, but yeah, I, it's probably a blockaded off area. And the thing is, they said run and survive, so we're probably still getting chased by the monster. I think it's evolved again, and the cutscene looked like it had evolved, so it's probably got a new form again. The last room actually didn't last that long. 
Well, that's an entranceway. Was there two and what the fuck is this thing? That which wanders. So you are the one in which flows the blood of our dark prince. I had heard of your existence from that which leads. I see now that you are indeed different from ordinary prey. And the other prey. I see. This too was foreordained from the time we arrived on this world. You seek the altar, the seat of the prince's power, do you not? Then I will tell you this. The hive is divided into several areas by function. To travel to the reactor room or the data storage room from the outskirts will require you to use the warp points. To use the warp points, you will need the nexus stones. Unfortunately, I do not know where the stones may be found. They are not necessary for us worker units. However, it is said that that which whispers has placed one of the Nexus stones within your world. You would do well to look for it. I look forward to the time when you shall bury the Dark Prince in an even greater darkness. Oh dear. Well, we gotta find a nexus stone or whatever in the hive outskirts. Jeez, this area is weird compared to all the previous areas we've been in. I think we just saw the monsters doing some fighting thing. You think that we might be safe from the monster? Probably not. I feel like that's not a thing. I feel like being safe from the monster in this sort of area. Did I just hear it? Fucking A. Just gotta wander through the darkness. I mean, the monster evolved again, so maybe its sounds changed again. That means it's kind of repetitive in this location, so I think we can probably discern it from the rest of the sounds. Okay, so this loops back around to here. God, I'm gonna go straight for a second. Get my sprint on. Yeah, let's check over down here. That's another dead end. Entirely another dead end. So much crisscross applesauce in here. Jeez. Yeah, I think we can go through. It looks like the middle area is gonna be safe. That's a dead end over there. The last thing to get marked on my map while my character decides that he's gonna have a heart attack is to go this way just to make sure there's like nothing here. Why was there a footstep sound when I was walking here? Oh, it's a trap! I guess that explains that. I'm not going over there again. I have to remember that those footstep sounds can mean traps. I'll take the long way around. Here we go, entrance anyway, right there. Take me in your walls, you great organic mass of whatever the fuck this tunnel is. It almost looks like a circus tunnel here, doesn't it? Da 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 smearing gore on the walls all of a sudden. Well, that might make for a fun circus. Some people like that sort of thing, you know? Grotesque circus. I'm just walking on ahead. I don't know what else I expect to happen. Is that a door? I think this is a door. See, so let's see if it opens. It does open. It's a door. Partition. Giant stone pillar. This was part of the altar in the great hall. It fell all this way. A bony stone. It's the stone that was on the holy ring's altar. It's covered in some kind of black liquid design. You got the Aboni stone. There we go. It's the stone that we wanted to get. All right, so that was really easily found. The one which follows made it sound like it was going to be some really heinous task, but literally it was just like five meters away from him. What a jerk. Well, we'll 
continue going through. I mean, I'm sure the worst thing is, I mean, this is too narrow a place. They couldn't send the chaser monster to come after us here. Even though I don't know what his new form does. But what if he can turn invisible now? That'd be terrifying. Oh, speaking of him, that looks like a corpse of him. Partition. That which withers. What is it? Why is there prey here? Or has the reactor created a new worker unit in the shape of prey? But why would this be? The hive has no need of a unit with this physical configuration. What is this prey doing here? I feel like I shouldn't have entered that room on my visit again. Yeah, okay, yeah, why is the prey here? I guess he's taking a break. I guess this is where the monster decides to hang out when he's not chasing people to death. Then again, he was just injured, but so there, I guess the monster is that which whispered. Never mind, it's not the monster. The monster's right there. Time to move. I thought that was the monster. That's something else entirely. Uh, behind me? I don't know what it does. I, this is a new form of it, so. It's on my map. Oh, it's coming, all right. Okay, it's like way over there. I have to go this way. There it is. Yep, it's on my tail. Oh, fuck. Let me get in here. Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay. Which way do I want to go? I'll go this way. Hopefully it's not a dead end. Oh, Jesus. It's a conveyor belt that goes the other way. Doesn't look like a conveyor belt, but that's exactly what it is from earlier. Let's switch over this way. This does look like a circus tent, doesn't it? Uh, I'm gonna check out this door first, see if it actually leads to anything. I'm losing track of all these robots. Like, what the fuck are you? That which consumes? Pray, sweet, delicious fear, filled prey, you which have come to the outskirts. Listen to us, this is not your place, you are not meant to be here. We know not how you came to this place, but you must go to the conversion room. After their long journey from the surface, during which their fear, fear grows and ripens, all prey arrive in the conversion room where that fear is harvested. That means you too must go to the conversion room. Do you understand? We await your coming with great anticipation. We look forward to the time when your essence, ripened and matured through your travels in the hive, courses through us. Sure! I didn't understand a word that they just said. Go to the conversion room. We feed on fear. Pray, you must go to the conversion room. Do you understand? No, I do not. But that's okay. Oh, fuck my head. Back in the room, back in the room. Now then, yes. I know there's a conversion room. I... Is it gone? It's gone. I think it's okay for a moment. Ugh. I'm gonna go through the circus tents. Da, 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 da. Checking out this door over here. Let's go. Okay. Well, I'm happy you practiced dramatic falling. That which crawls. What is it? Could this be that which we are told of but have never seen? Could this be prey? It is said that the unit designated as that which wanders has prevented its function and thinks like prey, feels like prey, even moves like prey. To think like prey, one must truly be perverted, for never before have we seen such a perverse form. Huh, the story's getting weirder. Not in a bad way, it's interesting, just kind of weird now. We have heard stories of creatures that wear perverse forms and live out their pathetic lives alone, separate from another called prey. Is this prey that stands before us now? Sure, we can go with that. Maybe. That with Trassel Dazzles? Oh my. Uh, that's another conveyor belt. That would loop us back around to wherever. You know, I'm going to loop around to see if there's anything over there. It might be not worth my time. I'm going to test it. Speed, speed, speed. Oh, jeez. Oh, he could have got off in this area. I almost missed it. Got to see what this leads to, don't you know? Might be a secret. There's no door. That door just scared me because I, I thought I had to go up to interact with it, but no, it's just a door that opens automatically. 
You're adoring and attractive. It appears to be a machine of some sort, but it's impossible to determine how it might work. Pedestal. This is, there's a stand with an opening of some sort. Perhaps it's used to hold something. Come on, we already know what it is. It's gonna be this rock. Save? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just <laughs> okay. I'm just kind of acting at this point. I don't know what the fuck I'm. What the consequences of my actions are anymore. Hive reactor area. See how is this different than where I just was? I don't know. So we're about to find out. What does this door do? Appears to be a machine of some sort. Uh, let me go back. Cannot be used here. Well, I guess I'm stuck here. Uh, hive reactor room. So now be a little bit careful in this organic mass. Let's see. I can, are these like teleporters? Probably. Let's see where it teleports me to. Yep. We're going to this area through teleporters. This could be something. Just have to be a bit wary how we explore this area. Thankfully, the map will probably be extremely useful here. Let's see, glance. Oh, there's another teleport, I guess I'll take it. Thing is, the, the stalker could just suddenly appear, couldn't he? So I'm teleporting every which direction in this organic wall mass area. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. Oh, he's behind me. I'm gonna take this teleporter. I don't know which way leads to what anymore. Is there a door here? I guess there is. Hatchery. That which hatches. We must go. Our body lightening the darkness. We must go. Go to the prince. Go to the altar where our prince awaits. Okay. I will say that this game has taken a turn for the interesting- oh geez, the monster's around here somewhere. Uh, I don't exactly know where he is, the problem. Ugh, oh, it smells bad down here, doesn't it? What, did you see something? Hey. I was talking with her for a second. Nothing, never mind. Yeah, okay, she doesn't have too much to say about this location, despite the fact that... Okay, where's the monster? I just definitely heard his footstep. Oh, he's appearing over there. I guess he can also take the teleporters, which I guess makes sense. Hive reactor room. Well... <gasps> oh, Jesus! Now, I, know he, I know he can take the teleporters, but... <laughs> He's gotten bigger. I will mention. Let's go inside this little door here. What the fuck? Hatchery? What's that? There's something something pushing into my mind. It's saying it's saying merge, assimilate. It's rages against having to be separated from a unified existence. It's angry. It's like a primal instinct. It wants to merge, to become one again. It's cutting like a laser into my brain. Can't shut it out. Assimilate, join with us. It's pounding like a hammer inside my mind. I feel like I'm going to go crazy if it doesn't stop. I have to get out of here.
Well, what's that? There's something, something pushing. Oh, yeah, there you go. So I don't want to do, get too close to that. 